Sea Neighborhood by Princess Ilke von Rothschild Chapter 5 Charity Kelly or why the idiots can't be on command A caterer can charge for a set $150 for any event where you might get some carrot cream, carrots, the cheapest vegetable of them all, a piece of protein, and acrimons, more carrots. The price includes all the personal who must work to elaborate the dish, also the rental of tablecloths, chair cloth, tables, chairs, cleaning, gasoline to get to the event. Depreciation of the vehicle as of its usage over time loses its value. Other overheads to then, and this is the main part, add a huge profit for himself. Catering is one of the most profitable businesses. The dish per se might have cost him precisely under five dollars. Five. 150 minus 5 equals 145 dollars. We are German. We see. In the annual push the parents to donate deep into their pockets, someone came up with an even broader scheme. Give me your workforce or whatever you do for free so the school can auction it to a friendly buyer and the school gets funds in the process. Not alone they commanded regularly, they also prescribed, you got to team up. Team up? I was to provide a opera soiree. The way I'd be doing. So I see it's a tremendous success. Kelly, now in charity mode for the world to see, offered to hand out lousy $300. Remember the number for the food to be served. Now, here is the snitch. I want to have your sorry for only six people. Your $300 for alone six people? Remember, Kelly expected to receive a fancy catering worth $150 per person at the cost of $300 for six people. That equals 50 bucks per person. The cheapest party she'd ever thrown. Making a buck as she goes, 150 times 6 equals $900, for which she saved $993,600. Get the opera for free. We can do better. What for am I denigrating myself to host the most elegant event of all times just because I sing in a pretty dress, for sure? I can do better, I said, for which Kelly didn't say, I don't wish you to do better. But she did say, I am inviting my elective group friends. So what Kelly wished was a bargain, private recital, for her and her friends, plus getting praised for such a generous act. Yet by then she only, in her so obvious ignorance, said, It's not possible. Not possible? To host at least 50? I found that greatest home, a school couple who already hosted school cocktail events and therefore public so convenient place, plus... They had a huge, almost commercial kitchen with countertops easy and elegant to present a decent buffet. Elegance all over. I called Claudia. We are German. In Germany, no idiot will purchase a catering event with our sole tablecloth and awkward semi-formal setting to eat mediocre to bad food overpriced. Remember the war? That stuck. Claudia, quick and easy. Yes, an event for 50 with 300. I work in the events. I can do it. Done. I too was founder and director of a cultural foundation, 
hosting events for years, yet no one ever asked, so nobody knew my history. See, for your information, a chicken costs under five dollars. If you pull the meat and roll it up in a real veggies like cabbage and carrots by a nar sauce, you get spring rolls. How many? A lot. Let alone sushi. How many sushi rolls may you prepare with only one cucumber? Thirty. I am not wishing to serve with rice in the tiny rolls aka sushi. I am making a point. Three hundred dollars is not much, yet it is possible. Here I go in hand. One, the concept, a brasserie. Two, the star, me. Three, the orchestra, mine. Four, the place, nice home. Five, the caterer, my friend Claudia, a reliable German, hand strong, get it done person. Six, the hospitality. My specialty, making all feel welcome. Seven, the professionally designed program and translation of the areas. What is missing? The box. Kelly, fighting her way through, admitted. If it's not my way, it's no way. Really? She wasn't allowed to host her five friend exclusively, so the idea to make the event memorable for more 49 school parents didn't entice her, and she bluntly and literally retired her funding. So much for charity. Think. Let's say we sell a ticket for $50 for charity purposes, not $250 to $500, the true worth of my art. Just fifty dollars. Fifty dollars times six. Ah, three hundred dollars. Could she not just write the school a check? Her valuable three hundred dollars. Fifty people times fifty dollars equals two thousand five hundred dollars. Nope. Kelly wasn't up for the school to get this much funds. Let's say we charge a hundred dollars. Other than Paul offering twice a ticket to Thailand, nobody ever got five thousand dollars for the school. Kelly, boycott of goodness. Needless to say, after that fiasco, she never talked to me again. She took the reject very, very, very personally. <laughs>